Good morning to you all. This is the Impromptu Speaker, day 20. Let's get cracking and get on with um, today's speech. Um, so let's have this one here. MPs expenses. This is a topic which was in the news an awful lot during the end of last year. I think it can be epitomised by an MP in the UK who has spent basically the public's money on a, um, I think it was like a duck house. It was a duck house. There's quite a famous image in the press over here, a photograph of this very majestic looking duck house sitting at the end of um, the MP's garden where he had a, uh, a lake. So not only were we uh, funding this duck house, but you know, the MP was living in a very, very uh, nice, um, nice accommodation. I think the, uh, the, the real thing that bit the, the public and certainly um, pushed some negativity towards Gordon Brown's government was the fact that we've been going through one of the toughest recessions in the last 50 years. Um, jobs have been lost, um, people have been cutting back, people are generally going through a very, very tough time at the moment. Meanwhile, the MPs on the other side of the fence are spending our money, our tax money, on, on luxuries which, frankly, they just simply didn't need. I mean, who really needs a duck house? Um, ducks, for the last, well, through evolution, for the last millions of years, have survived quite happily without having a nice wooden house created for them. So uh, I, that, that was a, a real, real uh, blow, I think, to Gordon Brown's government. And has he recovered from that? Well, uh, I suppose to a certain degree he has. I know recently the government has called back against the Conservative Party and they're doing slightly better. But even when I think about this now, and this happened at the end of last year, it, 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 it's something which was so idiotic. Um, that it's it's really hard to believe. So there we have the uh, MPs' expenses. I will of course be back tomorrow. I hope you're all well, and you'll be hearing from me soon. Thank you very much.